After sharpening their skills at the hotel, the advanced photography class took a bus to Old Town Carrollton to put their knowledge to the test. The purpose of the trip is to try to really get a story. I haven't shot in a while photos, and this is only my second year being a photographer, and so I'm still trying to get used to it. When the bus arrived at the square, everyone fanned out and began to find stories, going to places such as the Clayhorn Attorney Office building. But with the limited amount of shop owners to talk to, finding one that was comfortable on camera wasn't easy. Their answers ranging from quick nervous words to short sentences. So we just went into the candy shop and I tried trying to get a story out of the guy. He was just a little uncomfortable, which made it kind of awkward for me. But, but determined to get a good story, Griffith got to know Paula Smith, the owner of A Honey of a Deal, a ladies clothing store. At first, she was a little shy when Griffith first walked in, but after talking with her a while, Smith broke the ice. Doing this this summer, I think it's a really worthwhile thing, and it's teaching you a lot, so it's probably good to be going around to all these different businesses because everybody's different, especially on our square. We when they got back to the hotel, Griffith began editing her photos immediately. It was pretty successful, but I was just kind of looking through my photos, and I think I really got a story with some of them. I think they thought it was a little awkward at first. I think they liked that like someone had interest in them and wanted to know their life and everything. Out of all the photos she took, Griffith was able to find her favorite and turn them in, receiving compliments from her classmates. Edwards and Duncan Noose reporting for Gloria Shields Journalism Camp.